relationship between a rich man and a poor girl. There is always a bias towards a black man and he will never be president. Uh, a woman driving a sports car is probably a mistress. Uh, light travel to the street line, the world is flat, the atom is indivisible. So all these statements are not true. Uh, however, people still believe in that and making it true for them. So, I mean, this is a very simple thing. There are a lot of things that people tell you that are not true, but if you believe in it, it becomes true for you. And that's what's important. So people tell you that because you come from a poor family or you're not smart enough, you can't start your business. And if you take that in and you believe that, then it will become a reality for you. You can't start the business because of what other people impose on you. So even famous and intelligent people have beliefs that are wrong. So the Earth is the center of the universe. So Tommy is the Egyptian astronomer. There's no need for any computer more than 250k of RAM. This is what Bill Gates claimed in the 1980s when he started Microsoft. Uh, heavier than air machines are impossible. So this is the Lord Kevin from Royal uh, President of Royal Society. A man will never reach the moon regardless of all future scientific advances. So this is the inventor of radio. So all these people, they are the brightest people during their time when they make such comments. They make it to the public, tell everybody about this. And these are considered very, very bright people during their time. And yet, you know, they are wrong. So if smart people could tell you that, you know, you can't start a business because you're not smart enough, or your friends can tell you that, you know, are they smart people? And even smart people can be wrong. So stop giving yourself excuses. Stop having limiting beliefs because you are the only one that's preventing yourself from being successful. So, what limiting beliefs do you have? Uh, do you believe in the following? Limiting beliefs about you know identity and capability. Am I too young? Too old? Not talented? Uh, not smart enough? Not qualified enough? No luck for business? Uh, lack of drive? Uh, do I have mo I don't have motivation? Am I lazy? Am I not a good speaker? Um, never succeed in business. So these are very similar, simple limiting beliefs which sometimes I'm, I'm sure at some point some of you may have something, some of these beliefs that about your identity and capability. And sometimes people have limiting beliefs about money. Money is difficult to earn, you have to be rich to you have to be to be rich, you have to be already rich. Uh, money will lead to problems, it's impossible to have access to money, money is the root of all evil. So sometimes you have limiting beliefs about relationships and people. Uh, you must socialize and drink before you can network. Uh, people can't be trusted. Marriages never lead to happy endings. Uh, perfect partner is just a myth. And then there might be limiting beliefs about my career or business. So market is being saturated, so I can't go in anymore. Uh, my idea is really great, marketed somewhere. Someone has really done it. Uh, business is tough. No one will trust me with my new idea. Uh, it's hard to make money in a recession. There's no opportunities out there. I can't expand my business. Uh, it's hard to get a job if I quit, so I do not try. Uh, my business has reached growth limit. So even if you started the business, there might be you know, limiting beliefs that you have that prevents you from growing more.